Welcome back to the channel. Here we try to bring to everyone awareness of their rights and how to exercise them when dealing with public officials by going through the best moments of police interactions caught on camera. So if you are new, don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment with a like to help these videos get out there to help to end police misconduct. Now, as always, I will leave the link to the original video in the description, so don't forget to visit this channel and show me your support. Pretty. So. And we got an officer over here. Hey, See how this goes. What are you up to? Can I get your name and badge number? Sure, no price. What are you up to today? Just hey. taking photos. Okay, you got an ID on you? Did I commit a crime? Potentially. What crime did I commit? I don't know. Are you in trespassing from the law enforcement center? Trespassing? How can you trespass on public property? Uh, that's easy. Can I have your ID? No. How can I be trespassed on public property? Walk up here with me. No, sir. Can you articulate a crime that I've done, I've committed? I don't have to articulate that to get your ID. Yes, you do. Yes. This is not a stop and ID state. That doesn't mean anything. Yes, it does. Okay. Are you going to give me your ID or not? No, sir. I need to talk to a superior if you're going to keep keep this up. You can talk to a superior all you want. I sure can, because this exactly. is not a stop. Told you you could. This is public property, is it not? Sure. Okay. I have not went in no restricted areas. Look. I went right up to that sign that we says. We don't have to turn this into anything big. Are we you don't. Give me your ID or not? No. You're I going don't. around the law enforcement center and police cars filming, which is very suspicious. Is some suspicion a felony or a misdemeanor? Neither one. Okay. I have no reason to have to ID. Well, if I'm suspicious that you're committing a crime, I can identify you. What is the suspicion? Like I said, you, there's a number of criminal offenses you could be. Uh, what have you seen? What? Right now. What have I done? Give me a penal code. Well, I've seen you up against police cars trying to film them. I don't know that you broke that, into them. I don't. Is that public property? No. A police car is not public property. Excuse me. Who pays for that police car? Uh, I do with my taxpayers' money. So do I with my taxpayers. Well, you're not alone. So that means that's public property. All right, I'm going to take this knife off you. No, you're not, sir. That's that that's seizure. That's, that's illegal seizure. I do not consent to no search or seizures. We're going to put it right there. Have I reached for it? Well, I'm allowed to take a knife off of you. That is a legal search. That's a legal seizure. Right. So are you going to identify yourself or not? No, sir. Okay. I have no reason to. Grand Out 35, can you put me out with a 1088 uh, in front of 20 McGee, please? I am on public property. I have a right. This is a First Amendment protected activity. You're at 1041 Charlie, either the city or county that can be 105. This is a First Amendment protected activity. Okay, and that might be fine, but I just want to make sure that you are not committing. And any that is going to that now. you trying to ID me. Thank you. Is going against my Fourth Amendment. That's not true at all. Yes, it is. Being able until, to is not a until you until you can articulate a crime I have committed, you have no right to ID me. That's not true at all. Yes, I, it is. I articulated a couple of crimes. No, you, you didn't. Could have possibly Give me a committed. penal code. Did you did you did you go check the cars out to see if I broke into any of them? Thank you. Did you go investigate that? No, because I've had people walking up to me saying, "Hey, there's a super suspicious guy walking around the whole." Is suspicion. Filming. A felony or a misdemeanor? Look, I'm not going to answer your silly questions, okay? It's not a silly question. It, it is, is It is a true question. Is it a felony or a misdemeanor? We both know the answer to that. Is it a felony or a misdemeanor? I want to hear it out of your mouth. Are you recording me at the moment? I am. Same Thank you. you. Good. If your arm gets tired, you can just get mine. No, it's I'm good. Info, all right. Still 24, still 24. All right. We're going to wait until my backup gets here. and then we'll. That's fine. I would, like to, I would actually like to speak to a sergeant. Well or someone over you. You can call the non-emergency. No, number. I am requesting you to you cut out the, the have a superior come out here. Someone higher than you. Well, someone who actually knows the law. If you want to request that, you can call in and have, the, have them come. So you are denying my right of requesting a superior? Not at all. I said you can call and request. That's what it law. sounds like. I'm not going to call on myself. You, you. That's what you're a civil servant. I'm the public. Okay. I am asking you. All right. And like I said, you can, you can talk to a sergeant all you want. You just have to call in and uh, talk to him on the phone because he's not here. Who and he, someone you got to have a boss that's here. Sure don't. No boss. Nobody is over you. Nope. If you if you fuck up right now, nobody is over you to discipline he's not you. Here. I told you that you can call him on the phone. I okay. gave you permission to call him on the phone. I don't need your permission. Oh my gosh! All right. Am I being detained? Yes. For what crime? 
you have I have reasonable suspicion that you're committing a crime and you can't you can't crime. use that what crime have I done give me a crime I don't have a crime well then you don't it's an illegal detainment all right just stay over there for one second I don't have to stay over there please no sir I have not committed no crime I am on public property recording I have not went in no restricted areas What crime, what crime is that? Can I have a name and badge number, sir? Can I have a name and badge number, please? Thank you. What crime have I committed? This is public property. Just like you trying to tell me this is not public property. Taxpayers pay for this just like they pay for this. Yeah, that's fine. It's public property. I have a right to record this. I have a right to record anything inside there. I have not went into a vehicle. I have not touched a vehicle. You've got cameras all over this building. None of these cameras work. This building was built in the 1940s. That's a good thing to tell the public. Well, you 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 are doing great at your job. Um, how do I know you're not on trespass notice from the law enforcement center or the back lot? I never went in the back lot. I went to that sign. I have it on video. And if you want to see it, it will be you posted were walking up. through that breezeway, so you were in the back lot. No, that sign back there. Go read that sign. I saw you walking He's, he's the breezeway. watching me. He's watching me. Go around that corner and read that sign. I'm pretty sure you're parked back there. So you It says no public that way. No, 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 no. It does. Law enforcement center employees only. That says sign. no public that way. <sighs> that Are sign. you the public? Go read that sign. All right. ID me. Let go me go read that sign. No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. I'm not going to go read the sign. I know it says no public. It says no truck. Exactly. So how do I know you're not trespassing? I went. Sign was here. Oh, I did not. I never passed that sign. Right. Never passed it. So you're not going to let me ID you? No, sir. You have no reason. Give me a crime that I committed. You probably trespassed back there. Probably. Oh, my gosh. All right. Probably. Is probably a crime? Are we not here? I, I, I am. Don't All right. Happy I am. I'm falsely in the back lot. Is probably a crime. Is that your personal phone before you take a picture? I was waiting on it though. Oh, that's right. I will foil that. That's fine. Can I get your it's name, badge number, sir? Badge number? 1725. Thank you. All right. You have a great day, sir. Don't forget your knife. How about you go get it? You're the one who uh, illegally pulled it yeah. off of me. Illegally searched and seizures. You got it. Have a great day. All right. Try not to bother anybody. I, I, I was trying not to, guys. Y'all be safe. Y'all might want to educate him, though, on First Amendment and Fourth Amendment. Please, guys, again, help these kind of videos get out there as much as possible to help expose these kind of police officers and with enough noise, maybe try to hold them accountable because police officers like this should be fired immediately. And like him, many other cops think that they can do whatever they want and that we civilians have to comply with everything. But this one is so dumb that he even says it out loud in front of a camera. And to make it worse, it clearly shows that he has no clue of what our rights really are. And in this case, if there is no suspicion of you committing a crime, you do not have to ID yourself. But it's because of moments like this that it's so important for you to know your rights and to help us to bring awareness to the rest of the public. So don't forget to support the channel by subscribing, like the video and leave a comment to keep the conversation going. And remember, always record the police.